this Thibaut, we're gonna see today a circle picture animation. So let's see how it looks like. So I'm starting the animation. And then I have those cards coming in, those elements, with an animation on the picture, which starts from a circle position, it's becoming square, and then an effect on this text. If I start again, once again, let's see how it looks like. Okay, so let's see how it looks like in bricks. So in bricks, I have three sections, so the dummy start and ending sections, and then the Nagoya section for the animation. So I gave a class to all the elements. So the Nagoya is the Nagoya section, container is the contain Nagoya container. And then I have five, five cards. Each card contains a picture wrapper and a text wrapper. Uh, and picture wrapper contain an image and text wrapper contain a heading and a basic text. So I won't go through the styling details, but one thing to notice is that in the container, I have the CSS. And what I did for media above 668 pixels, because I'm changing the layout at that breakpoint. The uh, I'm changing the order between the text and the picture. As you can see, the picture here you can see, but the picture is on the left and the text is on the right. And here the text is on the left and the picture on the right and so on and so forth. So that is done purely with CSS. And also, I'm changing the text wrapper orientation, not orientation, but the text align position from left to right. So, for instance, if you had, if you add, sorry, uh, another card, it will automatically uh, adjust the position. Well, let's see how, if I had a card, you see, picture on the right, and text on the left. I had another picture, picture on the right, and text, a picture on the left, and text on the right, and so on and so forth. So that I don't need. So I will go back. Let me save just to be sure. Okay. Then I've done it with uh, today with Brickforge. So l let's see the animation with Brickforge. Uh, I try to be as lean as possible in the sense that I try to, uh, to minimize the code to add s the smallest animation and the, let's say, uh, adaptable animation in the sense that if you add section uh, cards, it will automatically uh be animated you won't have to 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 do uh, cards one cards two cards three cards four cards five and so on and so forth to animate them it will be automatically done because what i'm doing i'm, I'm doing one uh entrance animation for the odd picture so the third third fifth seventh and so on and an animation the same one but reversed on the even, so the even are the second, the fourth, the sixth, and so on and so forth. So for one timeline, what I'm doing is animating the cards, and I have a from two, and uh, from the trigger selector, Nagoya card and child odd, and I'm handling triggers separately. I'm not changing the scroll start and scroll end. I'm adding a toggle action of play reverse, play reverse, and nothing else. 
then for my trigger selector so I have a from so x minus 100 percent and y 100 percent to original position of zero percent on the x and the y and animating also the scale so from scale zero to scale one then I'm animating the picture wrapper so I'm doing a circle path circle 20% at 50% 50% so the center 220% still at 50% and 50% so basically it will got it will become a small circle to a big one and then the the square the, the the picture portrait will reappear as a square then i'm animating the um text wrapper so I'm, I'm targeting all the child of the text wrapper meaning the text title the text heading and the basic text so the text of the cards with a text wrapper superior and the star so that will target all the children so i'm doing a translate from zero uh sorry from 30 percent on the x-axis and 60 percent on the y-axis and it will get to the original position and what i'm doing too is a opacity auto alpha zero so auto alpha is the combination of opacity and visibility and a certain duration I'm using split text on the lines and a stagger of 0 0.3 seconds um, I think that's it and for the even I'm just changing the uh, few things instead of coming from the left is coming from the right so i have to instead of minus 100 percent i have to put 100 percent so the picture is coming from the right to the left and the same for the text the text was coming from the left to the right so 30 percent now i'm making from the right to the left so minus uh, 30 percent uh, I think that's it for today so thank you for watching and see you at another video